It's training camp season, and today we're going to get a good look at the Chargers because we're going to get our first glimpse at Lad McConkey. He's made some big plays recently in practice. We're going to look at those, but before we dig in, you need to click that subscribe button right now because we're covering your favorite players behind the scenes at training camp. Those rookies you're interested in, that guy coming back from injury who you want to see if he can walk all right, run all right in practice. Those guys you're going to be drafting for your fantasy team that you're interested in in the middle rounds. It's all going to be right here. Click that button. Stop missing out. We're looking at Lad McConkey today. We're seeing what he's doing at practice. A lot of these are the same clips but from different angles. But this dude is a play-making machine right here. Bringing it in, good concentration. Staying with the play too. We're going to catch this from a few different angles. Got a few other things. Just watch off the release. The cell tactic with the head movements. Breaking off the route. Creating separation. Here we go again on that same play, I believe. Rolling out with Herbert. Getting the ball out right behind there. Nice. And this guy's money. He's smart. He's cerebral. One of the best route runners. Might be already in the NFL. Definitely in the 2024 NFL draft. Highly drafted. Ran a 4-3, 40-yard dash. We got 4-3 speed. We create separation off the routes. Very good at getting yards after the catch. And he grew. And his stock just kept climbing during draft season. The Senior Bowl, he made money. The Combine, he made money. When the NFL draft aficionados went back to look at his tape, he made money. That's what Lad McConkey did. And he's in an offense now where it's open. He could take over. Like, I don't think Quentin Johnston is a world-beater wide receiver. I think Trey Palmer is a good wide receiver. But for a high-end second-round pick, who most years, or in a lot of years, could be a first-rounder with this speed and upside and the ability to just create separation off the route, like right there, right there. What I want to show on that one is when we're coming off the break, it's just right here, watch. We're handing, we're handsy, we're handsy right here. Watch the cell tactic right here, right here off the break. Just that little bit of nuance with the head. That little bit of nuance with the head, then watch them pop off that step. Just very quick, and you're able to get that much more separation to get the target. That is what makes Lad McConkey. That is the big feature. And then you add in the 4-3 speed, the ability to get yards after the catch, the ability to read coverages, just all around cerebral, steady Eddie, puts in the work. The workout clips are all over social media. All the rookie wide receivers... He's up there with having the most with all different other wide receivers in the NFL going back to his college and then even back in his college days. Workout clips, just showing off, just working out. This guy puts in the time. He creates the separation. And you're with Justin Herbert. You're going to get quality targets. We got a Jim Harbaugh offense. We want to see how that pans out here with the Chargers. We're going to stay open-minded. But we're looking at Ladd McConkey as being... The guy for this regime, they handpicked him. And we had about 20 wide receivers. I might be a little higher, even a little low, but I'm speaking off the cuff, that had round two grades or better. And they picked Ladd McConkey. There was other good wide receivers, and all these teams picked the guy that fit best. You had your boundary wide receiver, Quentin Johnston. You got Trey Palmer. On top of that, you got... Lad McConkey coming in as your separator, who could end up being your target hog. That could be your target hog down the line. Because Lad McConkey could definitely be that in the near future. Definitely could do that. You definitely want to look at that because I believe he can command a lot of targets in this offense, can really grow to be the guy, especially over the long term. Definitely could. Definitely could be a leader in this offense. Could pair well with Justin Herbert. Just his route running, his nuance, his tactician. He's there. 
he's there. I'm excited to see what he's going to be doing on the field as a rookie this year. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button on the way out. One thing for watching. Catch you on next video.